In this video, you will learn um, how to create an action in which you would click on an object on your page and it would link to another file. In this example, it's going to link to a video file. Um, I found this little flip chart on, on Promethean Planet and what happens when you hover over the picture of the deer, you can see that there's an action associated with that. I click on the deer and the action is launched, which is actually throws a video up there, a small video clip, and you can see that the video will start playing. It's a little bit ironic that you get the warning about copyright since somebody made that publicly available on Promethean Planet, but that's not my concern right now. Um, I'm going to close that video and show you how simple that you can do that. I'm going to um, drag out something from my resource library. I have um, from the bullets, buttons, and and uh, alphabet uh, resource pack. Is it alphabet? Oh, arrows. Bullets, buttons, and arrows resource pack. I have this little green blob. I'm going to drag that out and I'm going to assign an action to it and the action is going to open a video. So this assumes that I have a video in mind and it's saved to my computer that I want to play. So the way I do this is um, when you bring out the object, you can then go to the action browser which is that icon right there. And I would like to do an object, or a, we're gonna do a media action. So when I click on it, I'm gonna to wanna to open a file. In this case, it's a video file. So I'm gonna choose that action. And then I need to go find my video. So I click on this dot, dot, dot. I have a video on my desktop and it's basically an animated story, chicka, chicka, boom, boom, one of my favorites. And I'm going to click on that video and click open and apply the changes. And when you click on apply changes, you'll have some other little settings that you can um, do. And the main decision you need to make is whether you're going to store the file externally or in the flip chart. I'll talk about that at a later time, but I'm going to store it externally right now. And click off of my object. Now you can see there's an object associated with my blob. I click on it. And lo and behold, Chicka Chicka Boom Boom opens as a video. You could use any object to, um, to click on, or you could even put text on top of your, um, your object. So you could say something like play video. So that's how you link to a file and one example of an action.